Hey, welcome back to Delectable You. Today I have a special guest. This is my friend Hannah. She's visiting from New York and I dragged her into my kitchen so that she could help me make today's recipe, which is vegan eggnog. Because during the holidays, there are all these holiday drinks and holiday foods that everybody eats and if you can't have any milk or lactose or, or you're lactose intolerant or you can't have eggs, but you still wanna have eggnog, you should be able to have eggnog. So I am going to make that happen for you. Let me show you how to make it. Okay, so grab yourself a high-powered blender and you're going to add a cup of cashews that have been soaking overnight or for at least four hours and drained. And add two cups of fresh filtered water. And we're gonna blend this on high speed for probably about a minute until the um, cashews get nice and smooth. Okay, that's been about a minute and it looks like we have some delicious cashew milk. So now we're just gonna add the rest of our ingredients to the party. So we are going to add a 13 and a half ounce can of full fat coconut milk. We're gonna add a half a cup of almond milk. We're gonna add six large dates that have been pitted and they were soaked for a few hours just to get them a little bit softer so the blender would have an easier time um, getting them chopped up. We're gonna add half a teaspoon of cinnamon, more if you like cinnamon like I do. I'm gonna add a pinch of nutmeg a pinch of cloves, and a pinch of sea salt. And finally, we are going to add something to thicken this up a little bit. We're gonna add half a banana. And that's it. Now let's blend this all together until it's nice and smooth. Okay, that's been going for about two and a half minutes and everything looks like it's chopped up and nice and smooth and it smells delicious. Now I didn't add any sweetener to this besides the dates. If you want it to be sweeter, you can add a little bit of maple syrup, but I think you'll find that this is sweet enough. This needs to chill in the freezer, like the cool thing that it is, but um, right now it's really hot. We're gonna taste it anyway because obviously taste testing is the best part of being a guest on Delectable Hue. So I can't take that away from Hannah. So let's just test this. Normally I would sprinkle a little bit of cinnamon, just a little sprinkling. Would you like some cinnamon? Yes, please. Uh -huh. Always. Sweet. Not too much though. I'm kind of a cinnamon crazy person. There we go. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Happy holidays. You too. Thank you. And happy holidays to you guys too. So remember, Enjoy your eggnog, but first you gotta chill it in the fridge and it should keep in there for probably five days if it even lasts that long. Happy holidays. Thank you so much for joining me. This has been Lauren and Hannah with Delectable You. We'll see you next time.